Hello, today I want to share a very significant dream that I had. I was so emotional. This dream is significant to me, especially this season of my life. And as it concerns my calling too. So I want to share it with you because it is what a lot of Christians pass through. They just need encouragement. I believe this dream is going to encourage you in your Christian world with God. I had a dream. I saw someone who was being led to where he will be killed. There is this passage I saw. I was on the side of the passage, close to the passage. He was crawling. There was a practice. The practice is that if you are caught and you want to be killed because of your faith in Jesus Christ, you will crawl. And as you crawl, there is a gate. If you crawl past the gate, then nothing can save you. But if you stand up and recount, then they will let you go. So this man was crawling on his knees, like standing on his knees and crawling. He got to where I was. And he looked at me and I motioned to him. I said, move. I motioned to him with my head. I said, move. And inside of me, I was kind of, we are behind you. We are coming. I believed in that dream that he is going to get a crown of glory. And not that he was going to die for dying sake. So I encouraged him to go. I encouraged him to move. And I said, we are behind you in my mind. And there is this song I was singing. It is a hymn, the words of the song. Let me read the words of the song. For all the saints who from their labors rest, who thee by faith before the world confessed, thy name, O Jesus, be forever blessed. Alleluia, alleluia. I was singing this song in my mind and I was so sorrowful and I motioned to him. I said, go, we will join you. I encourage him to go. Please, brethren, whatever thing you are facing is a test of your faith. Don't give up on God. God Almighty knows what you are passing through. A lot of people are denying God because of hardship, because their hearts have been broken by loved ones. Please don't give up. The Lord Jesus Christ is coming back again. He will either come to us or we will go to him. Whichever way, please remain faithful to death. Second Timothy chapter 2, verses 11 and 12 says, It is a faithful saying, for if we be dead with him, we shall also live with him. If we suffer, we shall also reign with him. If we deny him, he also will deny us. Verse 13, if we believe not, yet he abided faithful, he cannot deny himself. You have become one body with the Lord. Don't deny the Lord. In whichever way the devil comes and throw aspersion or tribulations or trials at you, please don't give up. Stand to the end. A second in heaven, you will forget all your troubles, all your pains will be gone. Please remain faithful to the end. May the Lord God Almighty continue to empower us so that we can stand to the end. Thank you for watching. Please share this video, like and comment, and don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you have not done so. God bless you.